Okay, so today we're going to be learning about the average value um, of a function, which is in section, or chapter 4, section 4 in your textbook. So, the value of fc, given in the mean value theorem for integrals, is basically just called the average value of, of f on the interval a to b. Um, the average value is pretty much the mean value theorem, but revised a little bit. So if we look at the definition, if f is integrable, this is a major key to the average value theorem. It has to be integrable on the closed interval from a to b. Then the average value of f on the interval is 1 over b minus a, of the integral from a to b of fx dx. Um, so basically what this means is we are going to take the um, interval and we're going to subtract b minus a and multiply that by the integral of the derivative of the function. So that's all that means. And that's going to give us the average value. Um, so if we work out this problem, find the average value of fx um, of the function 3x squared minus 2x on the interval of 1 to 4. So first, we are going to um, write in our equation. So we know it's 1 over b minus a from the integral of a to b of fx dx. So what is b? We know b is 4 and a is 1. So this is 1 over... 4 minus 1 on the integral from 1 to 4 of 3x squared minus 2x dx. I just like to put it over there. Um, so when we go down, we know this is 1 over 3 from the integral of 1 to 4. Now here's where we're going to take the antiderivative of the function. So, um, we know that the antiderivative of 3x squared is just going to be x to the third. Because we know when we, if we had a 3, we brought it down, those 3 would sort of cancel out and we just have x squared. And negative 2x is just going to be minus x squared. Um, so now this is how we're actually supposed to write it. We're going to do 1 third x cubed minus x squared evaluated at 1 to 4. So from there, it's just a matter of plugging in. So we have 1 third 4 to the third minus 1 to the third minus 4 squared minus 1 squared. So inside we're going to have oops, 64 minus 1 minus 16 plus 1. Um, so when we get this all down, oh, and this is multiplied by 1 third, when we um, add and subtract everything on the inside and multiply by 1 third, we're going to get 16. And that's going to be the average value of that function. So, one more problem is find the average value of x squared plus 2 of f of x on the interval from 1 to 3. So, we're going to write what the average value is, which is 1 over b minus a, of the integral from a to b of f x dx. So, we know that b is 3 and a is 1. So we're going to have 1 over 3 minus 1 from the integral of the integral of 1 to 3 of x squared plus 2. Now, um, from here, we are going to take the derivative of this function. So we're going to get 1 over 2 times x cubed over 3 plus 2x evaluated at 1 to 3.
So um, now it's the same thing. It's just a matter of plugging in. So we're going to have one half, three cubed over three, minus one cubed over three, plus two times three, minus two times one. Okay. Um, so if we were to work this all out, we're going to get 27 over 3 here, which is 9. Um, this one, I have that. Plus, and this is going to be 6 minus 2, 4. And that will be um, your answer. And that is how we find the average value.